wanted to show you a new feature of the Honeywell Wi-Fi thermostats that they added with the recent soft software update a couple weeks ago. This is what our thermostat looks like now. There's actually an empty spot here, which will get filled in with the new utilities settings. If I hit the menu button and scroll down one and go to preferences, you see a new option, which is utility schedule options. This utility schedule options allows you to set times when you might have uh, variable pricing from your utility company and take advantage of that automatically without using a schedule spot on the Honeywell thermostat. If I click into that, I'm going to now turn that mode on, go to next. In my case, with SRP here, I want to utilize it for both heating and cooling cycles on the thermostat. Next. Do I have a different utility schedule pricing for summer or winter? No, in the case of SRP here in Arizona, it's the same, so I'm going to leave that set to now. Now it asks me would I actually like to set up my schedule. So I'm going to say yes. Um, in a, my case, we only have two levels, off-peak and on-peak. The thermostat sets or supports up to four different levels. In my case, I'm going to move it back down to two and then go to next. This is the warmest heating temperature I want to be it to allow during uh, peak pricing. So in my case, I'm going to move this down. I can either use the arrows or just drag it. So I'm going to set it to go down to potentially 60 degrees during that period. Hitting next then says, okay, for air conditioning, what do you want it to be? And I'm going to move that up to, we're going to move it up to 92 degrees. Hit next. Then it asks you what days of the week do you actually uh, want to follow that utility schedule. In our case, it's only five days a week and Saturdays and Sundays and holidays are excluded. So I'm going to select Monday through Friday for it to be in place. Does utility pricing change uh, during the day? Uh, for us, it actually does change during the day based on time. So I'm going to say yes. So when does the peak pricing start here in Arizona? Because of the heat and everything, it's actually at 3 in the afternoon is when our pricing plan goes up. So I'm going to turn that to 3 p.m. Hit next. And it asks me, is there another change? And ours actually goes off at 6 p.m. And then it goes to off-peak pricing level. Hit next. And then it asks, do we have another price change during the day? In our case, we don't. So I'm going to hit no. And then we don't have any different schedules during other days either, with the exception of holidays, and I don't believe they support that. So I'm going to select now. Then I can review what our schedule looks like. It shows that the pricing level will go to peak, the warmest temperature will be 60 and then 92. And then I can select done. Now it saves the changes to the thermostat. Um, I'm not going to put in a personal schedule, but if I go back now to the main screen of the thermostat, you can see that it shows that right now it's 3.27 p.m. here and we're showing peak pricing. So that's also another benefit of it. You actually see when your peak pricing is in place and when it isn't. So hopefully that gives you a better feeling for how the thermostat works and how that new functionality works. They just introduced it, but don't seem to have any information about it. So I thought I'd record this for you so you have a better idea. Thanks much.